Oh, I guess you've seen Alex then. Yeah, skip games, big deal. I actually came back to get my homework so I could go back to school. Well, if you'd have stuck around long enough this morning, like I said, I would have written you a note. You, you can't keep storming off like that, Liv. I'm trying to help. What about getting in my case? <laughs> is that what you think this is? Liv, I was at the party, I saw what Gabby did. I heard what she accused you of. Brilliant. I'm just saying, if you are trying to figure out who you are, you don't have to hide it from me. I'm not hiding anything, all right? Just leave it. Liv, please. I just want to help you. All right, there you go. How's that feel now? Better, yeah. It's just a shame that it won't get rid of it. Well, it'll fade, and then people will forget, and it'll give you a chance to figure out what's really going on. I'm not gay, if that's what you mean. To be honest, I, I don't know what I am. But you do know that's OK, don't you? Maybe you chose the wrong girl, or maybe it's too soon to even know what you are, or how you feel. Well, why? Everyone at school seems to know. All I'm saying, Liv, is it's OK to be unsure. You don't have to rush to label yourself. No, I get it. And you don't have to be so defensive for either. That's what I did. Look how messed up that turned out. Yeah, but look at you now. You know exactly who you are, and you've got one of the nicest guys you've ever met. Right, I'm not saying it's going to be easy, but you'll get there, wherever that is, with whoever. But you're my little sister, and I love you more than anything. So from now on, whatever you go through, I go through. It's you and me. And God help anyone that tries to come between them. Deal? Deal. All right, I'm going to get showered. You're going to make the tea.